We'll guide you through how to connect a USB to your iPad. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. Firstly, we need to check what port your iPad has. So all you need to do is come to the bottom of your iPad. My iPad here is USB-C and you can identify that because it's got a little line or sort of a piece in the middle. And if we look at a USB-C cable, that's also got a hole in the middle, it's hollow. So it's gonna go around that. Whereas a lightning cable is solid like that. So as you can see, a lightning cable isn't gonna fit in that because there's a little piece there which this can go inside of. Now go and get your flash drive. So here's mine. So this USB here is a USB-A. Some USBs are gonna be USB-C and this would work really well for me because I could plug it in directly. But if you've got either a lightning um, port or a USB-C port and a USB-A flash drive, then you're going to need an adapter. So here's an example of an adapter here. As you can see, this is USB-C, which can plug into my iPad. And on this side, we've got a USB-A. So this could then plug in here. But you can get a ton of adapters on Amazon. I'll put a link down below, which is an affiliate link, which supports the channel at no extra cost to you. But you can get a lightning cable to USB-A um, or a lightning to USB-C, all sorts. So let's connect it like this. And then what we need to do is go and connect the USB to our iPad. So here we go. Let's go and plug these in just like so. So make sure it's pushed in all the way. And then we need to go and open up the files app. So I'll swipe across and we can locate files just here. And in files on the left hand side, it should then appear under locations. As you can see, mine is called ESD USB. I can click on it and then I can go and see everything that's in it. And let's say you want to go and move some files from the USB to your iPad or vice versa. Then all you need to do is go and press on select in the top, select the files you want to move or folders as well, and then come to the bottom and you can click on move and then you can choose where you want to move them. So I just wanna move them to on my iPad, so I'll do that. And then you can press on copy in the top here, and then they're gonna be copied over. So I'll then click on on my iPad, and now they've been copied. So that's it guys, that is how you can connect a USB to your iPad, and then you can go and disconnect it, uh, and then you can put it into your computer or do whatever you want with it. If you found this useful, then please leave a like.